The rapidly increasing traffic congestion within Kampala has for many years been due to the construction of the city's landmark infrastructure. The executive director of Uganda National Roads Authority, Alan Kajina, says the good friendship between the government of Uganda and the government of Japan has enabled the development of infrastructure in Uganda. Uh, we have very good relations with the government of Japan and JICA has supported other projects in Uganda apart from the Nile Bridge which was commissioned a few years ago. Uh, JICA will also be supporting a road Yumbe Ure. Yeah, to, su to support the refugee area and we are currently in discussions again with JICA to support underground financing uh, a new Karuma bridge. That Karuma bridge as you know most of you is, uh, is uh, fairly old and is due for replacement. So these are some of the other projects which perhaps are not as well known as the Nile Bridge or the Flyover that we have uh, engaged and had fruitful relationships. Um, there was another completed project at Yak uh, Nimule that was completed, uh, I think, 2015. Uh, that road is now tarmac all the way to the border with South, Southern Sudan. So the, the, we, we enjoy a good and strong relationship with the government of Japan through infrastructure development. Vice President of Japan International Cooperation Agency, Dr. Yamanda Junichi, appreciated the work done on the Kampala flyover by the road upgrading project. As uh, you know, Ms. Kajino you know, told that the 80% has been completed for the road one, so I'm very satisfied with that number. The Kampala flyover project plot, which is at 80%, will be completed in this media, as the executive director of UNRWA explains. The progress that has been made uh, with the support of the funding, and um, where we are right now is going to be lot two. When we have finished lot one, then this lot, this uh, lot two, which one which goes right over to over Oasis Mall to Garden City and another branch which goes over to Ginger Road. That will be Lot 2. So we are standing in the location of Lot 2. But we've just visited Lot 1, which is uh, how many percent? 80%. 80 percent complete. This project will improve traffic flow within the Greater Kampala by decongesting the central business district. 